in order to sketch the graph of a function, it's, it's extremely important that you memorize the following basic graphs. Later we'll do some transformations with each of these. f of x equals x is a linear equation. Notice f of x is the same as y equals here. f of x equals x squared is the graph of a parabola. Notice the range is only y greater than or equal to 0. f of x equals x cubed is called the cubic equation. Turns out it's an odd function. Coincidentally, the exponent is an odd number. f of x equals the square root of x. That's the inverse function of f of x equals x squared. Notice if we reflected the whole thing around the line y equals x, it would not be a function. Notice the domain is only x greater than or equal to 0, and the range is greater than or equal to 0. f of x equals this absolute value of x. Looks like the letter v. Notice the range is only y greater than or equal to 0. f of x equals 1 over x, the reciprocal equation. This is an hyperbola only in quadrants 1 and 3. There's an asymptote, a vertical asymptote, and a horizontal asymptote. f of x equals the sine of x. The period is 2 pi. The range goes from negative 1 up to 1. f of x equals the cosine of x. This is actually the same as the um, sine function, except it's out of phase, so it's shifted over. Once again, the period is 2 pi, and the range goes from negative 1 to positive 1.